Good morning, good afternoon, brother, sister of Christ. It's the day the Lord has made. Now I had to get up, get up and give y'all my dream I had and what the Lord got me right quick. Y'all, all I remember, I was outside, standing outside, like at my cousin's house with my cousin. And my cousin, she married. But this cousin that is married sometimes, she, back in the day, she used to fool off on her husband. And I was at a house standing out, out in this field. And I looked in the sky, and I told her, look at something was in the sky. At first, I, it looked like it was just one thing, like an individual, one person standing in the sky. And as we looked, and I told her, look in the sky, she turned around and looked at me, y'all. Started turning out the sky was four horses, four men on four horses. Revelation. And above them, they was coming out the sky, but you know how a uh, spirit form what they were? They would start riding on these horses, and they was coming real fast. And on top of them, it says, Revelations. And they started coming down out the sky real fast, and they were riding the horses real fast, and they was coming towards us, right? And I was like, this is Revelation, because the word had Revelation on top of their heads. So four horses, the man, four men with the four horses. And they're riding the horses real fast, real fast. And all of a sudden, they came and they touched the ground, the land, and they started running. And it was coming towards us. And I was telling my cousin, I was like, we got to move. You got to move. We got to run. They coming. They coming. So we moved out the way and they came on the land. Then all of a sudden, the horses, I just seen them turning around the dust behind their feet. They just turned around so smooth and they started coming back. To touch the ground, they was on the ground and they were running back towards, like, the opposite way, towards us. And I turned around and she had a dog and I was like, we got to move because they're coming, they're coming. And so, all of a sudden, all I know is, you know, there was a spirit for them so you could see through them, but you could see them. And as I was trying to run, me and her dog, they was going so fast, we got swept in it and the wind picked us up. And... They was going, but the wind picked us up because they went through us. Like, it went through us, and the wind picked us up. They came along with us because as they went through us, they picked us up, and the wind was picking us up too, just how fast they was going. But they they dropped us down, and all I remember, they was running on the, on the land. And then the next thing you know, I stand up, and I looked, and I was telling my cousin, I said, the world is coming to an end. We, we, do. we all need to make sure we get our life right. And in a way, I feel like she was kind of hesitant because I think she was still in the midst of messing with her husband, even though she still seen Revelation, she, she still didn't believe it. And then I looked up in the cloud again, y'all. Something else was coming out, but I'm trying to remember what, what was it. seen y'all might been the Lord because all I seen was something like bright like it was coming out the clouds and I don't remember nothing else and I went to some other dreams but book of revelation y'all this was scary but let me give y'all the word the Lord gave me because Uh, the Lord been talking to me about a mighty shaking coming and the earth will reap its harvest and some days ago he had got me started on this 1960s show called Har Harvest Shame and it was talking about how Back in the days, I'm going to put the link in the bottom. Back in the days, how the government 
was taking advantage of the poor people. And they, these people were like, worked for, from six in the morning till like probably or three or four o'clock. And these people only would take a dollar home. And these people have five or six children. But the Lord told us it's going to be days like this, y'all. And it was getting so bad in this movie um, that people was trying to look for work. And a lot of them would pile up in these one vehicles. Everybody would go anywhere and travel everywhere for work. Because they didn't have, it wasn't like, it was hard. Like, wasn't no work out there. And people were following, trying to, um, trying to find work. I'm going to put that link in the bottom, y'all. But it's called um, Harvest Shame. And we know we're going into these days, y'all, but I had that dream of revelations. Because the Lord said, death, war, famine, and pestilence. Well, let me get y'all what the Lord gave me. He gave me out of uh, Hebrew revelations and it was Hebrew and revelation. These words came out of it. Look, revelation. It is time for this earth to reap its harvest. See that you do not refuse me who speaks, the one who speaks from heaven, who voice that is shaking the whole earth. A mighty shaking is coming. I promise all once more that I will not only shake the earth, but also the heaven. In my hand should be a sharp sickle, for the time has come to reap the harvest, for the earth is ripe. As I shake the heavens, many things are pouring out my bowls, for it is done. Many things will be shaking, heaven, the earth, and everything in it. There will be a removal of those things, also of those things that are made. The one thing that cannot be removed away is me and my kingdom. Darkness shall be upon the earth, a third of the sun, a third of the moon, a third of the stars and a third of the day will not shine. Likewise, night. I will continue to strike the earth with all plagues as often as I desire. Only ones who will make it through the shaking are my people who seek my kingdom, those who serve me with reference and godly fear. To those I will give grace. The earth will shake like a mighty, and great earthquake as has not seen since since men were on this earth as I shake this earth great Babylon you are remembered I surely have not forgotten you to give you the cup of wine to drink of the fierceness of my wrath and as I do this many will blaspheme me and my children my children do not forget what price is to be paid remember your reward and promises are with me you are mine and i am yours time is drawing near so please don't fear persecution is rising soon to be next don't accept any bets so the lord gave me that yeah the Lord said, the great tribulation is coming soon. He said, the great tribulation is coming soon. Near and noon, this place is doomed. Because the Lord gave us about doom the other day. Great tribulation is coming soon. Near and great. It's coming soon, y'all. Great, great tribulation. Seek my face and not those of men. He says, seek his face, not those of men. Allow him to come in. A mighty shaking is upon the earth. 
a mighty shaking is upon the earth. Seeking for seeking of those who are dying of thirst. Mighty shaking is among the earth, seeking those who are dying of thirst. I'll be coming, I'll be coming soon. I'll be coming soon. The Lord said, he said, I'll be coming soon. I'll be coming soon. I'll be coming soon. I'll be coming soon. This whole earth is doomed. Y'all get your house in order. Seek my face and not those of men. All those who die in a thirst, let me in. Y'all know the Lord rhyme with me. Y'all know it's early. We need to get our house in order. God is coming soon. Coming back sooner than what we think, y'all. People, people think God. This, thank you, Lord. This is why my cousin in that dream act like she had time. She act like she had time. She didn't have no time, y'all. You should see how quick. Y'all should have seen how quick these horses came out of this sky. Y'all, these horses came out of the sky with a blink of eye, like this. These horses came out of the sky like a blink of an eye, just like this. All I'm telling y'all, this stuff was so real, and it is real. All people just want to play. Y'all, Jesus Christ is coming back soon. Sooner than what we think. And people still playing. Y'all, we got to make sure we keep our house in order. Because in my dream, she didn't even want to. She seemed like she didn't even want to repent. And in a way, I feel like, too, the Lord got on me, too, for not telling them. I feel like that. Y'all. Yeah, y'all. She ever call me? I'm gonna put it in. Lord, allow her to call me. I'm putting it in her spirit, but she still didn't want to repent. Still didn't want to print. And I, that's what the Lord said. People, they gonna bless me, him, and his children. They gonna think we the cause and God the cause of all this this wreckage, and just don't know they the cause of it because of sins. Be ready for persecution, y'all. And we got to walk in obedience. Y'all should see how fast that wind took me. And it dropped me off. It was, that wind with them horses, it came so quick. Y'all, I mean, just like this. And I'm like, I don't even know where she was at. But the wind picked me up. And it, it it dropped me off. Cause 
they just came down and they were just came back. Like they flew down, they was on the ground. And then they, they flew out the sky on the ground and they flipped around and they came back. And I was like, cause I thought they was going that way. They came back the other way. And I was trying to get out the way because they was coming. It was just quick. And they just came. All I feel, all I felt was they just ran past me. Like I was still standing up, but there was in the spirit. And they just ran right past me. And all I, all I felt was the wind that picked me up from them. And it was on the land. I had to get up, y'all. I don't know what time this is. I had to give up and give y'all this real quick. <laughs> y'all be blessed. Get our house in order, y'all. Repent of your sins. Allow God in. A mighty shaking. Many not going to be able to stand, y'all. And this wind that picked me up through all this, it dropped me off. But I was in the midst. But the Lord also speak about wind too. Wind of destruction, y'all. But all, God said all the ones gonna make it. The one that fear him and seek his face. Y'all be blessed. Love y'all.